A late-stage trial of Eli Lilly's weight loss drug Zepbound showed promising results in treating sleep apnea symptoms in obese adults, the company announced Wednesday. The latest findings suggesting popular weight loss drugs have the potential to treat conditions other than obesity or type 2 diabetes. Eli Lilly said it would submit its research to the Food and Drug Administration for regulatory approval, allowing the agency to review Zepbound's potential for treating obstructive sleep apnea.39 million. That's how many adults in the U.S. are affected by obstructive sleep apnea, according to the National Council on Aging. Though Eli estimates about 85% of obstructive sleep apnea cases are undiagnosed. In 2022, the FDA granted Zepbound, Fast Track, approval to study the drug's uses for overweight or obese adults with comorbidities like sleep apnea. People with sleep apnea experience an increased risk of several cardiovascular diseases, including coronary heart disease, stroke, hypertension and irregular heartbeats, among others, according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. Obese adults are at an increased risk of developing sleep apnea symptoms, the CDC said. Drugs like Eli Lilly's Zepbound and Monjaro and Novo Nordisk's Ozempic and Wegovi, part of a family of drugs called GLP-1 agonists, have grown increasingly popular for weight loss or diabetes. Meanwhile, studies have suggested they could be useful for other conditions. A weekly injection of semaglutide, the generic name for Ozempic and Wegovi, was found to reduce the severity of liver disease in people with HIV, according to a study published last month. Novo Nordisk previously said late-stage trial data indicated injections could also reduce heart failure-related symptoms among at-risk patients. Adding semaglutide was also being tested to treat conditions like dementia or alcohol addiction. A mid-stage trial of Zepbound indicated promising results for treating fatty liver disease, Eli Lilly told investors in February.